When timely arrival is necessary, there's no substitute for airlift. Airlift is critical to the Army's requirement for rapid movement of mass firepower. Airlift deals with getting combat forces to the fight. At the same time, we must be sure we are attaining the most from our defense dollar. In keeping with the Air Force policy of realizing the most capability from an operational system, an enhanced capability test of the C-5 Galaxy was conducted in 1984 to verify features not previously demonstrated. With the fleet of C-5As undergoing wing modification and other improvements incorporated in the new C-5Bs, it became apparent that range and payload could be increased beyond the original design criteria by permitting increases in takeoff and landing weights. Any improvement in these areas would mean the Military Airlift Command could perform its mission more effectively. An Air Force test program was proposed to evaluate galaxy capabilities at increased gross weight, both in takeoff and landing, as well as in flight with aerial refueling. Another phase dealt with backing the aircraft using reverse thrust. Six flights were made to study performance, stability, control, and handling qualities at increased gross weights. Air-to-air -air refueling to attain the in-flight weight was accomplished with both KC-10 and KC-135 tanker aircraft. During the course of the tests, three new records were established. The world record for greatest payload lifted to 2,000 meters, 245,731 pounds, was set at Dobbins Air Force Base, Georgia. Two other national marks were also recognized. The greatest recorded weight at which an aircraft has ever flown, with a gross weight of 920,836 pounds and a landing weight of 876,762 pounds, the heaviest aircraft ever landed. The United States must maintain a very strong, responsive strategic airlift capability, providing the deployment of combat-ready forces when and where needed to protect our national interests. In situations where runways, ramps, and taxiways are damaged, the C-5's off-runway capability, already proven in a previous operational utility evaluation, would allow maneuvers around these difficulties. The ability to back up gives the C-5 even greater flexibility. Straight backing tests showed the C-5 capability of backing on level pavement at weights up to 772,000 pounds. A star turn maneuver was accomplished within runway widths ranging from 106 to 134 feet. Although backing the C-5 is not a routine operational maneuver, in an emergency situation, this capability adds that extra element to accomplish the mission. These Air Force tests have proven qualities inherent in the C-5 galaxy. That is, capabilities already there without any modifications. These capabilities in both the C-5A and the new C-5B can be used to meet airlift requirements that exist today. It has been demonstrated that enhanced capabilities in the C-5 extend its range and payload beyond original design criteria. This enhances the Air Force's ability to meet our global commitments in missions critical to our nation's defense.